Hello everyone, I am SV and welcome back to my tutorials. Today we are continuous create our first game in Unreal Engine 4. So today we will work little bit with our game interface. As you remember in last time we are create this game interface uh, with some health, some stamina, some score and today I like to make some exit, some possibility to exit. So what we will do? As you remember yeah, first we are create a button. We are going to button because I like to click it and put this button somewhere here. So name of this button will be like a something, I don't know, exit, something like that. Take this button and make, just a moment, button and make anchor point on the right top corner here, something like this. Then drag and drop it. So size will be same 200 for 200 and we will put somewhere somewhere on top. It will be 0 and it will be minus 210 maybe something like that. So this will be or minus 200 we will see something like that. Okay so exit button. Uh, what options and uh, we will use now? First of all we are going select a button and going to style open the style and you can see normal hover it and press it so uh, hover it and press it will be with same picture normal will be uh, with other picture but just just a moment i not remember exactly where it is or we don't make some present variant variation just moment we will have to wait a little bit somewhere here i not remember how we are call it yeah cross just cross we have cross texture and we have cross sprite so we can use a cross texture i think uh, we have something like that uh, yeah good we are not use a sprite cross texture will be enough we have it and don't forget to change draw s like an image same we will do for hover it cross same like image and same we will do like a press it cross something like that okay very good so we are create some some button we have this button uh, now i like to make game pause when i click this button so what we will do first of all compile don't forget to save on compile always and now we are select this button and we are going somewhere down and here you have some events on click it on press it release it hover it unhover it so i will make action only on click it go here and left click so coming some new menu uh, we have some event on click it exit button and what will be i am going here and i make game pause set game pause yes something like that so check how it's working we are start play come including screen which we are created in my some previous tutorial uh no any action we are jump start games looks like everything okay so now we will fix it yeah but if i push this button game going to pause pause and oh you see very nice looks like very nice uh why it's coming like this yeah i keep like this i like it i like it and why coming this problem because here we are forget when when we are pressed we are don't uh, we are forget change to image uh, should be like this but now for box it looks like more interesting so i will keep like this okay very good so we have it and uh yeah what we will do now we are create one more widget and my idea will be like that if i press this button coming some new menu where it will be some uh writing like a you like to leave the game or game exit or something like this and will be two buttons yes and no 
and after that we will make a choice if i put yes i'm going out from my game if i'm going no my game will resume so today our goal to make this widget and for this reason we have to use it doesn't matter what you are use adobe after effect or photoshop or doesn't matter but i show you very easy way how to make it inside in adobe after effect so we are going inside and we are creating new composition size of this composition will be full hd like our screen and we will make only for one only one frame just moment something like that so only one frame we have this composition what we will do now first of all i create a new layer solid like black one it will be easy to understood what is going on after that i create a text somewhere here and uh, give me a scene we will put something like a uh, why i cannot write something just a moment some problem again text right and we'll put quite game and question something like that so i put somewhere here after that will be some choice so i take again this tool and will be something like a no and will be something like a yes something like that so will be quite game no yes also i like to make a, some different color so this is like my basic idea and uh, now we will play a little bit with that one so how we will do it we are create new composition we are create new composition size of this composition will be very small 256 for 256 something like that create and we have it very small so here i put a text no something like that something like that very good and i put somewhere on the middle of this composition i think it is, it is maybe very small just a moment so select text going for a line and make it middle and middle something like that okay no i have it uh, also i like to make some variation so first of all no i like to make some by red color something like that also i like to add something just a moment red mm, okay it will be white and inside will be red maybe like this okay yeah like this will be good and i like to make some background so i create a layer new solid and color will be also also red so i just put on the background and make opacity for this color i put t on my keyboard opacity for something for 50 percent something like that okay and also i add to this color some mask mm, i think my letter is so very big i'm going to character so this is no and I reduce maybe 180, something like that. Again, middle and middle. Yeah, so opacity I have, and I like to make some round corner. I am going for a mask tool, select this rounded rectangle tool, and make just double click. Ah, no, negative. I have to select this one, and then make double click. Okay, as you can see, I have some rounds. Looks like very nice. Okay uh i'm going back to composition now i can delete this no and here i can put composition number two something like that you see i already have it and it looks like very nice same i will do for yes it will be very fast uh, i already have some parameters text yes very good so align middle middle okay then apply some solid now it will be some something like a green okay apply for the solid rectangle mask and change a text so this will be like a green maybe dark green something like that 
So for the solid, I will make capacity for 50% also. Something like that. Okay, going for my main composition and take and put this here. This, yes, I can delete. Okay, and last one, I am going to new composition. High will be 256, but this I will make a 256, maybe plus 520, I don't know, something like this. No, maybe more plus 256, we will see. I think it will be very big one. We will see which size we will use. Okay, what I have? 900. Mm, no. Seven hundred? No, maybe a little bit more, just a moment. I not remember exactly. Yeah, I think like this. I keep like this. So what size of this composition? Uh eight nine six four two five six, something like that. Take it and put some text. Uh quite game and question. You can use any font what you like. Yeah. Anyway, I put a little bit more. Plus something. Okay. Plus something like that. Okay. And uh, font will be will be black. Will be like that. Very good. So again, I put on the center like this and like this. After that, I'm going to first composition. I can delete this and I can put four. <laughs> Uh, and question for what we are create like this uh, this our composition number one was just like a pre-drawing like example where is we make some design after that we are creating each composition exactly what we need exactly our symbols uh, now we are going for composition we are going for composite add render to quote going here output mode and change our format from AV to PNG. After that, you go to channels and change RGB to RGB plus alpha. Then push OK. So we have this composition and we are save it somewhere on my desktop. I create a new folder, which will be tutorial. Mm, no, it will be not here. Just a moment. It will be inside in our project just a moment we are going for my computer d somewhere here and here i create a new folder which will be new test something like this it doesn't matter just to show you what is going on so i have and it will be no it will be just no why not save and render after that we are going for composition number two going for our text and just push this button and you see what is going on it is like inverted it is like inverted it's very very simple now we are going we are selected we are going again composition add to render quote Again, we are making same settings, something like a PNG with RGB plus alpha, and we are safe in same in UTS same folder and push uh, only other name. It will be no, but press it. P it's mean press it. For me, it's like this more simple. Render. Okay, and like this, you will make. Uh, with always yes with quiet game if you need doesn't matter so finally you will get like this i already prepared something you will get like this so i take a new uh, open you and you will get like this so for example yes no something like this you see i already prepare some exit high score play quiet high score your score game over and some additional some additional options also i prepare game uh, quiet game and some to the symbols uh, later later i will show you how to easily make it in cinema 4d 
or in other way you can download it somewhere from internet uh, anyway i will show you but it will be in my some future tutorials so when it is done when everything done we are take our yes and quite game copy for a moment and then put inside in our folder as you remember we have our tutorial game content texture and we are just make right click and paste inside so i have these compositions inside comp 7 8 doesn't matter so we are going back to our uh, our uh, unreal engine program and here i have uh, some something for import five import wait a little bit yeah i have to go in this wait and what is going on we are going to texture and this composition it is already inside so very nice uh, it is alpha so i can put it in any screen for this reason i'm going to widget and i create a new widget uh, user interface blue widget and it will be quite game something like that uh, maybe i can make a oh no i cannot make question quite game open and like usually like before we are create some widgets if you are didn't check please look to my previous tutorials we are make some widget what we are doing we are put some uh, image something like that inside in this image in this brush we are load a quiet game so as you remember everything like a comp where is this i think it is one yeah quiet game yeah we are used like image very good uh which size we will use we created for 256 and 1024 this is our size which we are prepared before so anchor point will be on the middle like this for this reason we can move it without any problem okay i put somewhere here after that we are create two bottom so take one bottom, put inside here, and I think also will be from its center. Yes, center anchor point. I take this bottom and size of this bottom. As you remember, we are create our composition for 256. It's mean uh, when we are put inside some picture, it will be exactly what we need. So normal, not I have to hold. I go to composition. So I cannot see exactly for this reason, maybe, yeah. I can uh, hold uh, counter on your keyboard and use a uh, wheel on your mouse. So it will be like this. It is not pressed. But when I put a mouse, it is will be like a pressed, like a white image, image. And for preset, we will make a same. So composition like a image very good so we have it uh, and we are create one more button one more button put it inside anchor point on the middle take this button put somewhere here make a size like our composition for this button 256 256 and going to make some options so i make it now a little bit uh, faster like this not press it and like this will be pressed composition press it and composition press it and of course i forget to change a draw for image but really it is not necessary uh, in reason that my picture and my size of this bottom it is same so for um, but anyway if you are changing it will be not so big mistake it will be just good for your experience okay very nice i have this and i have this i put somewhere on the more or less good distance maybe just a little bit here just moment something like one two three four five something like something like that i think it's more or less in good position okay and additionally so first of all this button i give a name name will be no very simple name this button game will be yes very good uh, this image i don't change and also i add for this canvas panel some extra or 
just a moment, give me to remember, panels, not panels, maybe it is in primitives, no, yeah, special effects, background blur, just take and put it inside. So take this background, make for full screen, and like I told you before, hold control on your keyboard, drag and drop here. Okay, now by blue strange, you can change, you see, we can make a blur. So I make a 10, for example, and put this blue, blur screen little bit here. So it will be behind, you see, yeah? Uh, very good. Compile, and, 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 what we will do now, just a moment, give me one second. And now we are save it. For a moment we are save it. So we are going for our bottom. You remember this game inter interface for this bottom. We are open our graph event and on this bottom what we will do? Our game going on the pause. Uh, but when it's coming we are create widget. Create widget. Something like that. Name of this widget will be, will be, will be quite game, yeah, I add to viewport, add this widget to viewport, very good, then I make pause of the game, and I remove, remove from parent, no, I have to remove this, remove from parent, where is this, remove from parent, Okay, remove from parent, save target. It's mean, when I click this button, I will take new widget, which is added to screen, but this my game vi game uh, interface widget, remove it from parent, it's mean going out from a screen. So now we will check how it's working. Mm, yeah, maybe I cut and put it here, and game pause will be later, something like that. So, save and play. We will wait a little bit, we have this loading very interesting and we are start play. So as you can see, if I push somewhere, it's not working. But when I push uh, this button, I have widget which is created. And as you can see, if I put mouse somewhere here, it's working. Also, don't forget, I have some blur. Now these buttons, of course, not working. So in my next tutorial, I will show you how to add some options for this button, for no, for yes, and how it make little bit uh, beautiful. So thank you very much for watching. See you in next time. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Goodbye, friends.